Hey guys, it's Brandon again. So this is just a follow-up video to the previous video that I did called um, Short Selling GameStop. Now a lot of people have been reaching out to me and they've been asking me what is short selling. So this is just going to be a quick video to break down what short selling is because it's a little bit confusing to most people. So guys, if you're stopping by to this channel for the first time, I'm going to ask you to like, share, and subscribe. Okay guys, so basically um, everyone on YouTube, they use the iPad, the uh, whiteboard and things like that, but apparently those things are too expensive and I cannot afford them. So today I will just be using paper and pen. So now, basically this is short selling. Say this is you and you own 10 shares of company XYZ, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You have those ten shares. Now, those ten shares are a hundred dollars per share. So a hundred times ten is going to equal one thousand dollars. So your entire portfolio of the ten shares is equal to ten thousand dollars because that is what the market is doing right remember the shares do whatever the market is doing if the stock goes up so does your your shares if the uh, shares go down so does your portfolio so we get that part right now this person comes to you and they said um you i want to borrow all 10 of your shares but for me to borrow all 10 of your shares i will give you a interest fee of about $1.50 per day. So that means you are now going to sign, go into a, a little contract and give the person your 10 shares, which is $1,000, but this person in return is giving you $1.50 per share. So this interest payment interest that's how you spell it i guess interest 150 times uh 10 that is 150 dollars a day this person is borrowing is paying you to borrow the shares now this is what happens this person now has your shares as soon as they get the shares they sell it boom sell your shares on the market for a thousand dollars so this person now has $1,000 in their possession. Now this person is waiting until the value of the shares decline. Now say the shares now drop to $50 per share. That means the portfolio is now worth $500. So this is now worth 500. So this person now, sorry, this person, they now buy back the shares on the market at $50 per share. So now the value is now $500. So this person sold your shares for a thousand, but of this thousand took 500 and bought back your shares on the market. So it gave them a plus of 500 and then they're going to return the shares to you at $500. Return the portfolio that is valued at $500. So they walked away with $500 plus and you basically lost $500. The only thing that came out of this transaction is that they were paying you the $1.50 per day. So that's basically how short selling works. Um, Every situation is different. The interest rates are different based on the security. And this is exactly what um, kind of happened with the AMCs and the, uh, the GameStop. So just in a nutshell, this is what short selling is. I rarely, rarely ever short sell. But um, and right now, if anybody's looking to short sell uh, uh, GameStop, it is very difficult because brokerages are actually running out of these shares uh, too short sell. So 
just to, to cover it, this is what short selling is in a nutshell. So yeah, guys, so that's basically what short selling is and um, how to short sell. It's very easy. It's a marginal uh, trades that you need. And for those who do not know what marginal trades are, it's just basically borrowing to trade. So guys, once again, thank you for stopping by and remember to like, share and subscribe. Thank you.